Now, AJ Lee has not left the WWE, regardless of what Yahoo has reported. I hate Yahoo's wrestling reporter because he just re he reports rumors and he states they're true. And then a week later, he has to retract them and say they're not true because he wants fucking people to read his articles. AJ Lee is not left to WWE. She is still under contract. She, they're saying she will be back. The thing is, she's injured and I guess she's been working injured and they're giving her time off to heal. She is still in WWE. AJ Lee is still in WWE. Don't listen to Yahoo. Yahoo is idiots. She's injured. They're saying she's going to be back in 2015. Probably by WrestleMania, she'll be back. So she's still there. Now, why are we getting... Nikki Bella as champion and why are we getting a feud with Natalia because there's really nobody else honestly I mean we got paid she's still featured fairly prominently I mean because you, you have to she's she's a star of the divas division uh, but the, the the divas division is so weak you you don't have anyone uh that's why there's all these rumors. Well, Lita's coming back. Well, Trish is coming back. Well, Eva's coming back. Yahoo has reported these are true. These are not true. That Yahoo wrestling reporter needs to be fired. And by fired, I mean placed in a cannon and shot out over the sea. But let's look at some of the, division, the divas. And, and see what we have. Who could... Uh, you know, who could be placed in this feud with Nikki Bella. Now, the Bellas have been featured prominently since they've returned, and before they returned, they were featured prominently because they were stars of the Divas division. And I think they only returned so they could star in Total Divas and be in the Divas division. Um, they are they are the, the secondary stars besides AJ Lee and Paige. The reason we can't feature Paige is because... Paige has been featured prominently in the Divas division as the star for the past six months. People will get tired of Paige. We have to send her to the back burner a little bit. Keep her, you know, so people know she's alive still. But let other people be the star for now. So that people don't get tired of Paige and want to shoot her out over the sea like we do the Yahoo Wrestling Reporter. So who else do we have? Well, AJ Lee is injured. Uh, for some reason, Brie Bella is teaming with her sister again. That was never explained. I am I am blaming an ancient voodoo uh, an ancient voodoo doll that we found in the temple of Irohito in uh, Southeast Asia. He was a samurai warrior who moved to Southeast Asia to get away from warfare. He created this doll of peace. And Daniel Bryan went on a great quest to find this doll. And he, when he found it, he presented it to Brie Bella and it made her make peace with her sister. So it is the ancient peace doll of Irohita that created peace between the Bella twins. That now cannot be broken. Makes as much sense as WWE writing, doesn't it? Okay, so we got Alicia Fox, who has never been over, will never be over, has never been over, and will never be over. She has been on the roster for like six years. She's never been a star. She will never be a star. She has no star power. I'm sorry, but Alicia Fox needs cut. Uh, we have Cameron. There's a option. Option. We'll, we'll call her option uh, B12. We have Emma. Um, I don't fucking know with Emma. I honestly don't. She got pushed. Uh, then she stole something from Walmart. They settled that case. And now we haven't heard from her again. 
I think she could get over. I don't fucking know. So we're not even going to include Emma. Uh, dress her in a bunny suit, I guess, and she can be a star of the Divas division. Eva Marie isn't ready. We have Naomi. We'll call her option uh, uh, C2. Uh, there's always Layla, who is 40-something, uh, injury-prone, but she's Layla. She's over, and, and people recognize her. She's never been that great, but she's an option. She's not a good option. We need to focus on the young divas, but Layla's an option. Uh, Natalia is currently in the feud. Natalia is another one of these people who... Everyone's like, Natalia's a feature of bad booking. That's why she's not... No, Natalia has been pushed, and she 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 just has managed to never get over. And I don't know why she has never gotten over. Probably because she lacks mic skills. And she's not that charismatic. But uh, uh, when she first came in, she was pushed to the moon. She managed not to get over. She was then sent to the back burner for a little bit. Uh, then she was pushed to the moon and managed not to get over again. To be a big star again. Uh, then she was pushed to the back burner. Then she got the Heart Foundation and was pushed again. So Natalia's problem is lack of charisma and lack of mic skills. She's been given opportunities, yet she just hasn't made it. And she's always a backup plan. But she's never going to be the star, people. Natalia will never be the star. I'm sorry. I like her, but she'll never be the star. But she's good backup. She's a good backup plan. So, so far, we have Cameron, Naomi, and Layla who could potentially be featured, though Layla is not a great option. So, Cameron and Naomi. Uh, Rosa Mendez, who will never be over in any sense of the word. Uh, we have went over Paige. Summer Rae, who just is a valet. And Tamina Snooker, who I think is still injured. So, in short, our features are Cameron and Naomi. They are the only chance we have of a Divas division right now without AJ Lee and with Paige on the back burner. And Sorry. Those are your options right now. I mean... I don't know. Put them in a tag team. Have them go after the Bellas like that. The Divas division is just too weak. It doesn't have the stars because it's focused on the Bellas and then it focused on AJ Lee and Paige and they never focused on making any of these other people stars. Or they focused on, you know, Alicia Fox who will never get over. Or they focused on Layla who is just too old. She's old. We don't need to focus on her. You focused on Natalia who's, you, you know, she's been given a chance so many times. It, it's not even funny, and she'll never be the star. I love Natalia, okay? She's a great wrestler. But she belongs in TNA, not in WWE. And so we, we need star power now, and we don't have it. And so there's no one left, so the Divas division is just going to be in a rut. In a mediocre rut until AJ Lee gets back. And because there's no one else, they need to make, they need to learn, we got to make stars of people. 